Well, at least seeing you like that brings back good memories. <gasps> Luke is out here, pull he's pulling some moves during a murder. Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we are finally back with the next part of Slumber Party. If you haven't seen the last one, go check that out because the tea is being spilled. We're finding out so much stuff. The door to the parents' bedroom is open. If you haven't seen these, you're probably going to be lost. But anyway, they woke up from a supposed slumber party that they were having and they found a girl croaking dead on the floor. So now we got to figure out who did it. But so the door and the window are open. So someone entered or it's just we're going to see what happens. But before you do, of course, go follow the amazing author Lucky. His Instagram is linked in my description box down below. And let's start the drama. Diana, who could have had access to this room? No one. Our parents locked it before leaving. I don't understand. But dead Diana, I feel like wouldn't you or your brother have access to this room somehow? Like they're just going to close off this room? A little weird. Well, obviously someone got inside because there's a broken window. I don't get it. It makes no sense. This was the only locked room. Maybe the killer thought we wouldn't get in? That would make sense. We almost didn't check this room. I still don't understand why pick a locked room when all the others are available. That makes everything harder. Why would a killer complicate his task? Do you even hear yourselves? Do you think we'll solve a murder talking? Why don't we search the room, idiot? Something obviously happened here. Asher really has a lot to say for being such a suspect in this whole situation. Wow, Asher, calm down. We don't need more pressure. He might be aggressive, but he's right. Well, look who just emerged from her existential crisis. Thanks for the support, Jenny. Once again, how does he have friends? Who invited him to the sleepover? Because I know they can't genuinely like him. He's so rude. Mm. I just, all right, guys, let's get this over with. Anything can help us. And Miss Jenny over here, I slept with Sean. It could be pregnant with this baby. That's a little plot twist. That was in the last chapter, too. Oh, speaking of it, let's go back to the past. Let's find out what happened. Let's see. Three months ago. Autumn, you're up. I bet you couldn't sleep. Today's a very exciting day, isn't it? Uh, what's today? Saturday? Is it? Today is homecoming, Autumn. Okay, girl. <laughs> like, okay. You're going to have to pick your favorite dress. Oh, I would kill to be your age again. Oh, no. Is this one of those, like, parents who want to vicariously live through their kids? I mean, not literally. You know, being old is not fun, but I have you. Oh, no. My beautiful daughter going to him, coming with her very handsome date. Oh, no. She's living for this. Oh, crap. I forgot about homecoming. What should I tell her? I'm going to stay here and eat pizza. I ain't going to that thing about that. I just want to stay here and eat pizza. What are you saying? You will eat pizza, but not here. There. No. With that handsome Luke, he seems really into you. Did he tell you what he was going to wear? You should wear matching outfits. Uh, no. Mom, stop. I said I want to stay here. You're nervous. Girl, what are you under? No, we're not going. It's okay to be stressed, Autumn. But you're going to look so pretty. I can't wait to see which dress you picked. Okay, can her and her bags under her eyes just stop? Like, stop. What am I supposed to do with this? Like, I wasn't feeling enough pressure. Just don't go. Sneak back in your room. Ain't no one to go to homecoming. Shall I answer my calls? Mm, after he posted on, um, what was it, Twitter or something? Or he texted that, that she cheated, even though she did no such thing. Mm. We were supposed to go to homecoming together. Well, I'm glad we're not anymore with Mr. Violent over there. I even bought a few dresses for him. Return them, grab the cash, and go buy yourself something. Like, do it. What's the point in keeping them? He obviously doesn't want to talk to me. Return, sister, return. Maybe we could try them one more time before throwing them away. Ooh, let's throw them, let's just throw them away. Return them. Cocktail. She looks so sad. Frills. Ooh, ooh. we're not going with that one. That looks, I mean, okay, like, the cocktail dress is, like, the cutest one, in my opinion, but I feel like the lace one's also cute. It's something a little different. I like the lace. I like the cocktail, too. Ooh, it's a hard decision. I kind of like this one, though. Like, if I'm going to pick one of the two, I think this one's, like, I like this one better. That's just me, though. Too bad I won't be able to wear it anymore. No, but return and go get your pizza. Go home and live your best life. A life goes on, I guess. Who is she texting? Wait, no. Oh, of course, Miss Tanya. What a surprise. Tanya just posted this. Are they back together? 
I'm angry. Well, <laughs> see, well, maybe see, well, you never know. I'm gonna kill them. Mm, I mean, maybe Autumn did kill Tanya. Whoops. How dare they? We're taking a break. Sean's a little snake is what he is. I don't trust him. The more I learned about Sean, the more it's like he is not the right fit. Yeah, you're a broken window, Sean. That's exactly what you are. I, he probably punched it with his anger. Did you find anything? Yeah, I think the window was broken from the inside. What makes you say that? Well, if it had been broken from the outside, the pieces of glass would be inside. It's logical, but here the pieces are outside. So it was broken from the inside, which means the door was forced open, or you did it. Hmm. So it means the person who broke in was already in the house. Yeah, nobody came in through that window. But something broke it, and I have no idea what that was. Well, if you looked closer, Sherlock, you would have guessed what it was. Hey, what are you doing outside? I just discovered broken glass. I saw it too. That's why I'm outside. See, Luke is over here doing his duty, Sean. But look closer at it. You'll see what I'm talking about. I'm looking, but what is it? Is that blood? I don't know, but it looks like it. But we didn't see any wound on Tanya's body. Yeah, I know she was strangled. It makes no sense. What if it's not Tanya, but the killers? Who is hurt, everybody? Strip down. Time to see which one of you was wounded. We need to figure this out. Now I have an idea. What do you mean you have an idea? What is he up to? Everyone, take your clothes off. Ooh. What is he doing? Uh, I knew someone was going to lose it sooner or later. I'm not losing it. Maybe the killer cut himself when the window broke. We saw blood on the pieces of glass, but there's no cut on Tanya's body. So one of us is probably hiding a cut somewhere on his or her body. All right, come on. Take your clothes off. I don't... Oh, Matt, you don't want to get naked? You can keep your underwear on, Matt. We don't want to see you naked either. We want to solve a murder. I'm glad you agree with me, Asher, for the first time. Oh, we're going to see who doesn't want to take off their clothes. Yeah, right. Don't think it changes the fact that I don't like you. Autumn, what are you doing? Well, Luke is right. It could help us. It's just underwear. Come on, strip to your underwear like us. I wonder who's not going to do it if anybody doesn't do it. Like, that's so, like, I feel like the blood isn't going to be... Okay, back to the past. There must be an explanation. Sean wouldn't do this to me. I refuse to believe it. I have to go to homecoming. Oh, I don't need to talk to him, do you? The only question is, how should I go? I can't go alone. I wouldn't dare. We go to homecoming with me? What? Luke, I could ask him. I feel bad for using him, though, but I need to know the truth. Oh, she's going to use him. I mean, the way he was doing her earlier, it's... Oh, well. <laughs> hey, I'm surprised you're calling me. I was waiting for a text after your mother's ambush. I figured you didn't want to talk. Hey, I am sorry I gave you that impression. But yeah, that was awkward. I didn't know what to say. It's okay, I understand. So why did you decide to call me now? Well, I thought about what you said in the car the other night. I said a lot of things in the car. I talk a lot in general. About homecoming. Yeah, I think I already apologized for that. Actually, I reconsidered your offer and I would like to go with you. What? Really? What made you change your mind? Uh, I don't know. I just thought it would be a good idea. Oh, girl, you should be honest with him. Luke is the type of person that I feel he just pr would prefer the honesty. Like, he was very blunt with her about liking her, even though we said no, but, and he kept pursuing, but it's fine. Can I ask you something? Are you accepting because you want to or just to make Sean jealous? Sis, you better not lie. Just tell him the truth here. Do I really? I'm accepting to make Sean jealous. Ooh, let's be honest here. Well, I'm gonna, we're gonna be honest. See, she's gonna be honest. I almost lied, but I was like, no, 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 no. I saw Tanya's latest post a selfie with Sean, and I want to know what's going on between them. So yes, I do want to make Sean jealous. Oh, okay, I understand. But hey, that doesn't change the fact that I enjoy your company. You're a good listener, very easy to talk to. I'll be happy to have you by my side. Yeah, does 7 p.m. at your place sound good? Sounds good, I'll be ready. Well, then I'll see you tonight. I feel so bad for making him sad, but... It's honesty. Like, I, I feel if we lied to him, it wouldn't have gone good. Oh, I mean, you know what? You just gotta be honest. Sorry, Luke. But it had to happen. It would hurt your feelings otherwise if you found out later. Okay, so everybody's out here popping off. So who's wounded? <laughs> oh, oh my. Okay. So, which one of you was hurt? <laughs> I 
<laughs> plot, it's odd. I'm like, nobody seems to have cuts. It's pointless. Well, at least we know none of us got cut by broken glass, which made things even harder. Now, I really thought that would have helped us know who killed Tanya. Let's think. The blood didn't appear by magic. Something obviously happened. There was a fight. But we don't know how, don't know why, don't know when, and don't know who. So this isn't getting us anywhere. Well, at least seeing you like that brings back good memories. <gasps> Luke is out here pull He's pulling some moves during a murder. What was that? I heard whispering. What did you say? Nothing important, really. We're already enough under enough pressure. Don't whisper behind our backs. Keep your violence in check, Sean. Hey, calm down, Sean. He's not worth it. Chill out. Yeah, you can stay over there. So can we get dressed again now? I've changed my mind. I, Sean, goodbye. It's all about Luke. Yes, this experiment was a failure anyway. Has anyone seen my pajamas? On the bed, I think. Oh, right. It fell on the floor. Thanks, Jenny. Is she going to find some? It's under the bed. How did it? Oh, I don't get there. I'm a little nervous. What the? Guys, I found something. What is it? There's a necklace under the bed I saw before I know who it belongs to. Can we get a flashback? Okay. <laughs> okay, so he's arriving for a little homecoming. All right, this is it. Luke is the here. So you're taking my daughter to homecoming? That is so sweet of you. Thanks. Thank you, Luke. Uh, you're welcome. You raised an amazing daughter. Mom? Autumn, I was just talking to, with Luke. Yeah, we're going to be late. We have to go. Wait, let's take a picture before you leave. Mom, please. This is so embarrassing. Come on, Autumn. My only daughter is going to homecoming. I want a picture. This is a great idea. Let's do it. All right, let me get my camera. Just so you know, that picture will be going in our family photo album. And also my lock screen. <laughs> Aw. All right, lovebirds, look at the camera and be a happy couple. Mom, we're not a couple. For now, sweetie, but homecoming is the perfect night too. Mom, do not go there. I don't want to hear it. All right, get closer to Autumn, Luke. Autumn, smile for the picture. Aren't you happy? Like, can she stop? I'm so over her mom. Maybe that's just me, but let's do Give him a flirty smile. Whatever. Get ready to take Okay. <laughs> All right, they're having a little homecoming moment. We'll see what they do. Yeah, we take the screen. Okay. So, Mom, I feel like you've taken more than 10 pictures. 22 to be exact. All right, should we take a goofy one now? No, we're running late. We'll be go We'll take the goofy picture another day. Yeah, right. See, Mom, I love how he was like, we'll take it another day. He was sent. He's trying. He's really trying. For some reason, originally, I thought the mom was going to be wearing the necklace in my head because low-key, she's a suspect to me. Why do your friends look like they're fighting? Because they are. It's really silly. I don't even want to get involved anymore. Do you want to talk about it? We can talk about anything but that. These friends are a little bit too much into each other's business. Like, they care way too much. He didn't tell you in front of your mom, but you look beautiful in that dress. Oh, look at him being all sweet. Oh, look who it is. Compliment him back. And you look really handsome in that suit. May I have this dance, Miss Autumn? Oh, I, I don't want to go with the crowd. We don't have to. We can dance here on our own. So what do you say? It's just a dance. It can't hurt anyone. Luke went closer. He slowly took my hands and started leading the dance. The music slowed down. The lights turned darker and the spotlights lit up. Don't look so sad. I'll hear him tweeting, hanging out with Tanya. Luke was looking deep into my eyes, almost reading me. He smiled. What did he read in my eyes? What was he thinking about? I don't know. After a few seconds, he leaned closer. Our lips were almost touching. Ooh, they go in there. They about to really kiss. I could feel a tension between us, almost electric. When suddenly... Uh, I'm sorry, Autumn. I have to take this call. I'll be right back. Sure, don't worry. I'll stay here. This is... Jenny, are you okay? Why are you crying? What? No, I am I wasn't crying. Hey, you know what happened with my sister and your friends? I don't want to get in the middle of that, but you don't have to pretend you're okay right now. You're right. I'm not okay. I'm just a huge mess. My friends hate me. My boyfriend broke up with me. I'm all alone now. Yeah, I get the feeling. Autumn came with Luke tonight. What really? Yes, this break was a bad idea. 
Oh, love sucks in a way. I'm definitely not made for it. Don't say that. I'm sure everything will get better soon. How? I don't see how it could. Well, I know what y'all are about to do. I deserve it anyway. I'm a bad friend, bad girlfriend, even a bad daughter. My grades are going down. I'm just a mess. That's what I am. Mm, they're going to comfort each other. Don't say this, Jen. You're nice, funny, and pretty. <laughs> Thank you, Sean. Come on, stop crying. Like, stop, sis. Thank you, Sean. Thank you for being here. Sean, know what about Autumn? We can't do this to her. Okay, at least I know Jenny has some. She came with someone else, but you love her and she loves you. I don't need to love someone. Th this dude is psycho. He's psycho. Okay, little Miss Cinderella story. Like, <laughs> what is he doing? Why did you call me? I thought we were done. What? You thought we were done? We will be done only when I say so. What do you want, Tanya? What I want, what I want is pretty simple. I want to know how our little plan is going. Excuse her? Her little plan. Oh, look whose necklace it is. Mm. Tanya is just a bad seed. Mm -mm -mm. And then that's the necklace Tanya was wearing for homecoming. What is it doing under the bed? Wait, she was already... Why are you looking so scared, Sean? You out here a little nervous that we found this. Hmm. Yeah, she still has a necklace around her neck. That are right. Why would she bring a second necklace to a party? Maybe she was wearing two necklaces? Why would she lose one here and not the other? I don't know. It was just an idea. This is so weird. Oh my. Who turned the lights off? That sounded more like cutting the power. Wait, but everyone is here. Let's stay calm. Maybe it's just an outage. I doubt that. Or maybe we're not alone in this house. What if there is someone else, like an actual murderer? Uh-oh. Mm-mm. Okay, so now we get some backstory. Luke and Tanya are somehow working together. I'm assuming this is to set Autumn up. So maybe Sean didn't tweet that. Maybe they had this little, like, thing, like, fakely done. And Tanya's really trying it. So Luke is in on this. He seems a bit angry, though. So maybe he wasn't completely for this, but he was somewhat for this. So everyone is so suspect in this story. I don't trust any of these people. They are all a mess. This friend group needs to be dissolved. To be cool. They're too messy. They are so messy with going behind each other's backs. With doing all that. The drama is too much. The drama is too real. I mean, the drama is lit for us because we get to read it. So honestly, they can keep making all the drama they want. But in real life, they would need to. They just need to goodbye but for the story in the game on the other hand bring it on but what do you guys think who do you guys think did it <laughs> for like a split second i almost felt like the mom her mom was gonna be wearing the necklace and like the mom was gonna end up being like the murderer because she is so hellbent on like autumn being with like the handsome boys so but let me know what you guys think let me know your theories and no spoilers of course go follow the amazing other luckies instagram is linked in the description box down below and the shout outs a big special shout out to Violet Riverwater, Kyla Myers, and Tashina Mitchell. Thank you so much for all your love and support. It means the absolute world to me. I am so sorry if I butcher anybody's names as always, but thank you for your love and support. It means everything to me. And if you want a chance to be a shout out in the next video, be sure to hit the subscribe button if you aren't already. Like the video, so hit that thumbs up and comment down something below and you could be chosen at random. But thank you so much for everything and I'll see you in the next one. Bye everyone. Yeah, she's urban with a smile They can't